Hey everybody, so update for you for Sarah. Um, it's been a difficult week. Um, she can obviously, she can talk a bit now. Speech is still not great. Um, she hasn't been on her feet for, this is now exactly a month. And bear in mind, she was in a coma for two weeks and she's not been on her feet. So, um, during this week, they've done an edge bed sit, which is literally just what it sounds like. They sit her at the edge of the bed to see if she can sustain her weight. They stood her up today, but using this sort of stand-up machine thing that does sort of 70% of the work. So, But effectively, our muscles are just gone in our legs. Um, and they have to come back. Um, the same with the speech. So she's kind of learning to speak and walk again, um, which is... You know, uh, difficult. Um, she had she there was some fluid on her on her tummy that they just couldn't shift with antibiotics and stuff. So they put a drain in, which is effectively just what it sounds like. They numb the the side and they poke a big fuck off needle in, and then they they have a tube and it drains out and uh, that's working. So that's good. She's been sick quite a few times, which is a bummer because she can only drink some. Well, no, she can't even drink. She's allowed to have swirl water in her mouth and spit the water out. Um it's been it's been a low week for her. It's been a tiring week for her. It's just been a, a bit of a shit week. Um I've been there a lot this week. This is where the hard work starts really. Um especially but for Sarah. Um but yeah tomorrow which is Thursday they're actually gonna move her from the ICU to a normal ward but still a higher up ward so she'll not be in intensive care anymore which is incredible but it's, it's been a month so yeah it's been absolute crazy so it's uh it's going to be quite hard work i don't think she'll be getting out anytime soon I and mean, when she does there's going to be probably four to six months rehab at home uh aye hard work but she's she's having good days and bad days but it's a lot of work for her. She's so strong. She's so strong. I love her so much. Um, but yeah. Sorry. Um, uh, that's the seven day update anyway. So uh, thank you very much to uh, everybody. And to the, like, I, I'm hoping I can open my shop again soon. I haven't really thought too much about it. But um, the, the competition that Grant done for the raffle that Grant done, all the paintings that you guys keep buying, that... It allows me to be able to go to the hospital and sit where for five hours, come away for an hour and a half and then go back for another three or four or five hours, or, well, three or four hours. So you are really, you are, you have no idea the things that all you, sort of, you all you people have done for me by, again, I'll never just ask people for money. That's not the type of person I am. But the fact that I can do these paintings, which are coming, I'm I'm doing them all. I just want to do them all and go one big massive post stage. You know what I mean? But um, the money that I rate that Grant helped me raise with the raffle, which was it, what you have given me, is so much more than money. So much more than money. That's why I'm I'm doing the still doing the commission paintings. I'm still selling the originals and stuff. You, what you've given me is is the ability to be at my wife's side as much as I possibly can. If And I, don't get me wrong, I love my dogs. I wouldn't get rid of them. But if I didn't have them, I'd be there all day and all night. Um, so it's got to the point where I, I cannot leave. She has to she has to tell me to leave the hospital. Um, so, yeah. Uh, thank you very much. I, I really, you've given me, you've given me the ability to be by my wife's side for as much as I need. So, don't know when the shop's going to be open. Yet. Hopefully, I will. It will be open soon. I'm trying to be positive. Um, so yes, thank you very much. And if you want a commission painting, give me a shout. If you want to buy one of the Frightened Rabbit originals, they're all on my Instagram. Um, I've put them up. I'll put them up. I've, I have put them up in the stories, but I'll also put them underneath in the little highlight things. Um, yeah. So. Thank you very much again. And that's the, the seven. Technically, I'm a day late, but it's the, the, the weekly update on Sarah, okay? Also, she's she's asked me to say thank you very much to everybody. To Grant, 
the um, Frightened Rabbit, the Frabbit postcard person, to everybody that's bought a painting, to everybody that's ordered a commission, to everybody that sent a, a message. Um, yeah, so onward, the hard work begins. All right, I'll see you in a week. Take it easy. Bye.